analysts largely attribute the worsening unemployment situation in Africa to the problem associated with skills development, especially in the era of the fourth industrial revolution. Many researchers say a result-oriented research strategy towards addressing this predicament is the way to go. In order to strategically improve agribusiness, financial inclusion, healthcare, among others, governments and various stakeholders have been urged to pay attention to technology entrepreneurship. Professor Nathaniel Bosso, the Oliver Tambo African Chairs Initiative Chair for KNUSD says they are seeking to liaise with the Ghana Education Service, parents and other stakeholders on the need to prioritize entrepreneurship at the pre-tertiary and tertiary levels to boost employment opportunities. There are two things we are going to do to try to change the mindset of Ghanaians when they come to entrepreneurship as a career path. So, so one of the things we, are, we want to do now is to work with the Ministry of Education to try to get parents, teachers in pre-tertiary institutions and even in tertiary institutions to begin to have a different mindset about what it means to be pursuing entrepreneurship as a career path. Right? So we will see a lot of engagement with them. And as I said earlier, we are also develop, going to develop an entrepreneurship competence framework for Ghana. And we are going to do that together with the Ministry of Education so that we are able to come out with a kind of skill set that we can use to train our children when it comes to entrepreneurship. And so, so that's one of, one of the things that we expect to change. So with this mindset, beginning with, then with the research that we are going to do, being able to demonstrate empirically that when people engage in entrepreneurial activity, either intensively or globally, we expect those people to be able to get out of unemployment. Because with entrepreneurship, you're able to employ yourself. And if you employ one, one additional person, you are, and if you, let's assume you have 100 enterprises with an entrepreneur himself and, and also employ one more person. You got 200, 200 people getting employment. So that is what we want to do. But then we really, really want to establish with evidence, empirical evidence for people to be clear that when you engage in entrepreneurship, you are likely to create a job. He has been highlighting what the research team seeks to achieve in order to help address Ghana and Africa's unemployment woes. Three major activities that we need to uh, accomplish. So currently we have, we have been engaging with industry people and uh, policy makers. Many of them you saw uh, give a presentation today. So with that in engagement with the industry and policy people, we are going to also continue to develop our technology entrepreneurship uh, program. So this is postgraduate program in PhD level and master level. Then with these PhD students, uh, master students, we are going to be engaging in a kind of research I was talking about, technology entrepreneurship research and how is related to uh, uh, youth employment. So uh, we are expecting to do this research across Africa, not only Ghana. So because this is uh, an African-wide chair, and our goal is to try to explain how technology entrepreneurship is uh, related to youth employment. So Dorothy Ingila, Director of Strategic Partnerships, National Research Foundation of South Africa, is hopeful that with a conscious effort Africa will be transformed as unemployment rates would reduce. We would like these chairs to support development objectives, especially of our continent, of the country that they are located in. In the case of Ghana, in this particular uh, chair, it is in the area of youth unemployment and the leveraging of technology and entrepreneurship to support um, livelihoods of young people. And the last aspect about this chair that is critical is its contribution to higher education objectives. So training the next generation of scientists and academics and 
producing cutting edge research and innovation that supports um, knowledge, that supports society, that supports the economy of Ghana and the economy of our continent.